everybody, so the Geo Challenge is back. And this month I have to find a geocache like on someone's property. I don't know if I've done that yet. So that's the cool thing about these challenges is it pushes me to find caches that I might not have normally found. So here's what we're gonna do today. All right, there we go. These are the attributes for this geocache and there it is, in front yard. All right, so let's go see what we're in for. All right, here we are. There's a, there's their house. Don't really want to give away too much. Oh, look at it. Oh, my camera's getting soaked. Woo. Oh, look at that little marker there. Oh, what a cute little cache. Oh. All right, let's check her out. Ooh. The good thing about these ones on private property is they are always in good shape. Look at that nice right in the rain log book. There is a trackable in there. I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna take it. Oh, some little cute little toys. You got the pen, Rory? The pen. <laughs> Thank you for the pen. All right. Do you ever wonder if the people that own this cache are watching you as you find it? Anybody here own one on their property? Do you watch people as they're logging it? I probably totally would. <laughs> I need to put one on my property. All right, a gadget cache, watch them struggle. That's what I'd do. If I put one on my property, it'd be a gadget cache. But then I can also come out and help them. Okay. I believe in you. I, I, I want to believe I can do this. There we go. I don't want to be that cash that just doesn't put, put the lid on. It gets all wet. Nice. There we go. Private owned on property. Geocache. Geo challenge complete. It's a little dragonfly hanging out on the tree next to the geocache. All right. So done with the April. Wait. No. What month is this? April? Yeah. All right. So done with the April geo challenge. Thanks to the geocaching vlogger. If you have no idea and you haven't heard about the Geo Challenge after all these years, which is okay. Uh, I will put a link to Joshua's video in the description below where you can check it out and try to win yourself a Geo coin, which I totally won one and I'm so excited. But I still like to do the challenges anyway because it gives us a reason to get out there. And uh, like today, it ha helped me find a uh, <laughs> geocache on a private property. I was always a little timid about them, but I, I don't mind it. I think they're very well kept. And uh, what'd you think? It's fun. Good. <laughs> All right, guys, so that is it for the Geo Challenge. Thanks for watching this video. If you haven't already, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't, and uh, we will see you next time. Bye.